we've heard about how we need to cull deer, but it was a young, healthy animal. I'm wondering if you felt any kind of emotion while you're there, cutting it open and sort of taking it to pieces. It's an odd thing, and people don't really understand this, that to do this job, you've actually got to love wildlife and deer. Yeah. It's a bit of an anathema to people. They think, well, you, you, you claim to love deer, and, and yet you're shooting them. It seems like a paradox, yeah. And it does seem like a paradox, and I appreciate that. But if you haven't got that, that drive to be absolutely fascinated by deer and their movements and their, their biology and their behaviour and everything like that, the motivation to get out on a morning like we've had this morning when it's cold and it's dark and you've skipped breakfast and you haven't had your coffee and one thing and another is not going to be there. You've really got to love, love the job and love doing it. Yeah. And part of that is a real passion for, for deer.